Hey guys, let's go Brendan Russ. I'm reporting this today. Uh, shout out to Old School Warrior for our talking his comments in the comment section of my latest video. You guys should check it out. But this is a poem right here that I wrote back in high school. It seems like right now it, the world could use it. I've always kept these put up and I don't know why, but I want to share them now. Because in there, right now I feel like they mean more than ever. There's something he said, you know, in my comments that just made me want to just do this. But it's called chaos. Chaos fuels the world we know, allowing hatred to burn in men's souls. To only deep inside us, all is looking for release. Only time will tell when it can break off its leash. Who will be the one that chaos devours and rise up to show the world their almighty power? As their hatred fuels their pride, they feel no one can stop their plans. They believe that they are messengers of God sent to punish all the lands. With wars burning through countries, destroying everything overnight, and bombs dropping overhead, innocent people try to stay out of sight. As they hide their face to watch everything they worked for be destroyed, causing them to live in the streets and become unemployed. Famine and droughts sometimes run through lands, causing chaos between locals due to food and water being high demand. There's not enough to go around for everyone to eat. Starving locals begin to riot and fight in the streets. Guys, that right there has got a lot of significance. With everything going on in the world right now, with the locusts and stuff over in Africa and the droughts in certain places, I'm telling you, the earthquakes. What I filmed last night in the lightning, I'm telling you, he was holding a set of scales. Literally, look in the pictures. I will add pictures at the end of this video. That way, for those who haven't seen the actual video, I mean, it's... When I noticed what it was, it really scared me. I'm not playing it. It really freaked me out. Because I've been feeling lightning for ten, over 10 years, and I've never seen nothing like that. Nothing. It was crazy. But, uh, guys, um, thank you for, you know, hearing me out with this one. I'm probably going to start doing this a little bit here and there, you know, as it pertains to what's going on with what we're filming and things. But thanks, guys. I'll be signing off now.